These numbers reveal a very stark reality. Reality may be unpleasant, but the numbers don't lie. COVID-19 is not going away. In fact, is getting worse. Thursday, Governor Greg Abbott said masks are now required in any county with at least 20 cases of the disease. If we want to protect those we care about, we need all Texans to join this effort. Oh mask orders in Dallas and Tarrant counties I don't have a mask. haven't been without some pushback. I've seen the video that you're referencing, and, and, and that's troublesome. Mark Pavero is a Fort Worth police officer, but he's also the mayor of Hudson Oaks in Parker County. We simply don't have the manpower to be answering those types of calls for service. He won't be enforcing the order in his town and calls it an overreach. Governor Abbott has left it up to local law enforcement, making the first violation a warning and the second a $250 fine. Any uh, situation where a law enforcement officer is involved with the public, we always want voluntary compliance first. Statewide hospitalizations have doubled in 10 days. I can see how people would be upset, but it's a small price to pay for what the studies have shown. More people in the state tested positive in the past three days than all of April. Completely easy thing that you can do to just kind of make things safer for everybody. Enforcement and opinions vary. The reality is the numbers aren't getting better. We just need everyone to do their part to help to slow the spread. People sometimes ask why we don't wear masks when we're reporting. Well, we do actually wear them when we're out talking to people. There's an exception for broadcast, but if there was anybody around right now, I'd be wearing one. And one other note about this order is while it starts tomorrow at noon, there's no end date set just yet. Live in Fort Worth, I'm William Joy.